October 4, 1964, Workman finds 31 star flags under floor of ancient bank building. Workman making preparations for restoration of Indiana's Otis Bank on North 2nd Street haven't found any money yet except an 1829 half dime. But Frank Telfer, one of the workmen, found a bundle of partially charred and decaying 31 star flags this week. Telfer discovered the flags rode in a charred bundle beneath the second story floor above the vault. After peeling away several layers of undistinguishable charred material, Telfer said he came upon the two partially destroyed ensigns. The bottom half of each is missing, however, the top six stripes and the field of blue with 31 stars remain intact, although badly decayed and faded. On the field of blue, the stars are arranged in two circles of 16 and 10, around a larger star in the center with a star in each corner. A hastily examined of a flag books in the Vincennes Public Library does not reveal any such flag ever being the national ensign. However, such flags were apparently common as guidons for horse cavalry units during the Civil War, since several similar guidons are shown in available reference books. When by whom and why were the de decaying flags put there? How were they burned and when? If they are regimental guidons, then to what ancient military unit did they belong? Picture above shows ancient flag here. Frank Teflon Center displays one of the two ancient flags found last week while working in the Indiana National Bank on North 2nd Street. The 31 star ensign thus far represents a mystery as to its use, with Telfer or Terry Shoulders left and John Hamilton right.